we have calculated a valuation for primary gold of 30 cents per share. We determine this valuation by completing a detailed cash flow analysis on the Mount Bundy Gold Project in the Northern Territory. A PDF version of our valuation and financial forecasts is available at the Sophisticated Investor website. The key assumptions that we examine in further detail include our mine life, gold price, gold recoveries, as well as our capital and operating cost assumptions. We also compare Primary Gold to their peer group of Australian-based large tonnage gold development companies. Our valuation assumes ore is initially mined from only the Rustler's Roost and Tom's Gully deposits. Whilst our mine life assumption takes into account most of the current resource for each deposit, we believe there is still significant upside potential in the mine life, as we do not take into account the Quest 29 deposit, nor do we account for any exploration success despite the significant brownfield and greenfield targets that have largely been underexplored for much of the past 20 years. To illustrate the potential uplift in our valuation if the mine life was extended, we ran a number of different scenarios. However, this only considers increase in the mine life and does not account for a change in the head grade nor the plant's throughput. But it is likely if exploration is successful, both of these factors would most likely differ from our current assumption with a positive effect in our valuation. We will examine each of these factors in more detail in the future. The Australian gold price has performed strongly during 2016 as the price has strengthened from less than $1,500 per ounce to reach a high of more than $1,800 per ounce. Our valuation has assumed a flat gold price of $1,750 per ounce over the life of the asset. But as with all commodities, the gold price will likely continue to fluctuate in the future. We therefore examined a range of different gold price scenarios to highlight the effect on our valuation. We note for every $100 per ounce change in the gold price, our valuation changes by approximately three cents per share. Given the current stage of development, there is a degree of uncertainty regarding a number of our key assumptions. We therefore completed a sensitivity analysis on these assumptions to highlight the potential effect on our valuation. Our analysis found that even on the triple downside scenario, which decreases recoveries, increases capital and increases operating costs, a scenario that we believe is unlikely, our valuation was still higher than Primary's current share price, which highlights the robustness of the project. And finally, the table highlights Primary's peer group of Australian-based large tonnage gold development companies. Our investment analysis video provides a more detailed examination of the similarities and differences between Primary and their peer group. However, one key aspect that we do note is that the average valuation per resource ounce of the group was $115 per ounce, which is a significant premium to Primary's current valuation. If the average valuation was applied to Primary's attributable resource, their valuation would be $0.27 cents per share, which supports our current valuation target of $0.30 cents per share.